How's it going, everybody? Today, I want to do a little video showing some of my um, old new leaf letters, as well as the best friend chat. Um, this is mostly just for a test for the capture card, but I thought that either way, it might be a little entertaining to check through some of my old letters. Now, I don't want to go through the um, friend letters like I got from my villagers. I'm more so interested in um, like the Nintendo letters that they used to send, and I guess kind of really anything that stands out to me. And then, I don't know, I just want to go through the best friend chat, just to see all the people who have disappeared over the years. Um, currently, Steven is the only one that I really still talk to. Um, it's a bit tragical, but it happens, I suppose. The first thing I want to do is check out the letters, so I'm going to go do that. Talk to Stitches real quick. And all my villagers think I'm a disappointment, it seems, but that's okay, because I took care of them in the long run. They're uh, well-fed, have nice land, so I don't really have too much to complain about. So, you're going to notice that I have an overabundance of letters. Um, I'm a pretty big hoarder in the Animal Crossing games. And when I was younger, I used to save, like, all my letters, as you can tell. Just pretty much anything I ever received, I would save. I don't really want to go through them currently, because there's so many, I'm pretty sure everything's full. But, like, I just wanted to see these old post office ones, because it's been a hot minute since I, uh, attained these. Like, the bell records, got all the badges. I remember the Happy Home challenges were kind of kind of a pain to go through. Um, I wasn't too good at figuring out what went with what, so that was a big learning curve for me, because New Leaf was the first game I actually tried to like get my house decorated towards like a certain theme or whatnot, and I don't know, I, I like the rewards in this game. Like, I think one of the rewards you got was a golden house. I don't know if that's in New Horizons or not, but I miss those kind of cool rewards. Because in in the New Horizons, I think, the only thing you get are, like, the wall plaques. But maybe you get something else, too. I don't know. And I think Dizel might have been one of my old friends. Evidently, I got him a lot of gifts. But it's just... It's cool that New Leaf is sort of like a time capsule. You can look at all these old things, all these old people you used to know. And maybe someday I'll go through all my photos that I took in Animal Crossing New Leaf, because that'd be a huge video. But this letter here is one of the Nintendo sent letters. Um, I believe this was the last letter that they actually sent for New Leaf. And maybe one of the only letters they ever sent. Um, I know, I think it was Japan that got the 2017 cake. Maybe it was 2018? Something along those lines, but... I don't know, I wonder why they didn't do more letters sent out like that, like City Folk did. Maybe it was... I don't know, actually. I think the reason they did it with the Wii was because they had Wii Connect 24, and that sent everything, maybe? And then, with the 3DS, you kind of just had to be online to get it, so maybe they just didn't want to, like, keep the servers open for too long sending letters? I don't know. I just wish they sent more of that kind of stuff. I know you could get the um, spot pass stuff if you went to Best Buy and whatnot, and those were always cool, but I do wish they were more uh, readily available, versus just having to go to like giveaway towns and whatnot to get them. But it is what it is. I'm, I'm glad they kind of did it a bit more with New Horizons, like sending out the unique stuff, but it could have been done a bit better for this game. I don't think I saw Katie too many times in this game. She never really wanted to appear for me, but maybe I had to visit other players more often? I don't know. But I do have a crap ton of letters, so I don't think I'm going to go through all of these. Because I don't know that there's any more really unique ones in the B and C categories. So... I just want to keep, keep checking a little bit, because I am very curious, though. I'm assuming a lot of these are just from the parents in the game, and 
single one. Counter close. That's cool. Future self. Oh, this was the, um, so for Toy Day, what I used to do, I used to write down what everyone wanted in letters. That way I could check. I do like the New Horizon simplified that a bit better. You not having to um, talk to your villagers in a month to figure out what they want. You just, um... Aren't you, like, told on Toy Day? I don't know. I forget how it works. I want to go check the Dream Street suite real quick. So, the Dream Suite didn't work. Um, I think they're doing server maintenance. So, currently... I do want to check my little BFF chat. Um, this was the first person I ever added on here on my 3DS. He uh, asked me for the Astro furniture one day and never came back online. And Valerie, I'm still friends with her on the Nintendo Switch. I haven't actually played with her in New Horizons at all, but I used to play New Leaf with her all the time. Um, mayhap someday I'll play New Horizons with her. Lucy, um... She used to be someone I played quite a bit with as well, um, mostly through BFF chat and talking. Um, I'm not really friends with any of these guys on here, outside of maybe one or two of them on Discord, but... Oh, same birthday as me. That's cool. Um, I do remember her. She was Lucy's sister, I believe. I don't think I played with her quite as much, but some of these people just disappeared after one day, and... I kind of get to wondering if that's because they deleted me from the friends list or if they just never played again. I know some of them probably didn't because they would appear occasionally years later, but some of them just completely vanished. Like Boss Todd, I'm pretty sure that I'm still um, friends with him on the 3DS because he added me on the Nintendo Switch. Is the same name on there as well. But he, this guy, he was the one who inspired me to get all my badges because he had quite a few of them. This guy and Alfredo. Is it, I think it's Alfredo, but he inspired me. Nicholas is one of the people I play with as well. Uh, I don't know if I've played with him too much in New Horizons. But here's Alfredo. This guy also kind of inspired me because he has quite a few badges as well. Um, I remember looking back at this being so amazed because at the time, I think I only have like maybe three or four badges when I met these guys. And I was just really amazed. And Olivia, I played with quite a bit um maybe not as much as valerie but still a decent amount i don't know if that instagram is still a valid link feel free to check if you want to um i don't remember too much about candy like some of these people i just added one time just because i thought they were cool and then just sort of never talk with them again um lamage i think i played with this guy maybe once or twice i think he liked pokemon I think we might have played that once. Um, Lucas, I don't remember too much about him. If Chances are, if they don't have their Dream Suite address listed, these people were people that I um, played with before 2016 and never played with after, probably. Um, this is Nicholas again. I remember he had two profiles because he deleted his first one. So I added him again. Um, Rethel is someone that I played with quite a lot. Um, I'm friends with her on the Nintendo Switch as well. Um, it's just, it sucks that you lose contact with these people. Like, when I was younger, 13 or 14, 13 when I first got this game, you just, you think you're going to be friends with these people probably forever, but down the line, they all start to disappear. And it's just, it sucks that New Horizons never really had a Club Tortimer, because all these people I became friends with from Club Tortimer. Um... I don't think there's a single one that I knew outside of Club Tortimer beforehand. Um, Kiki was a hacker, as you can tell. She, um, I've done it on my other 3DS. You can put in a custom image there. It's really cool. But, as you can tell, she hacked all the badges in. Um, Naomi, I want to say I played with a few times. Towards the end of the list, there are people that I started to play with less and less, except for Steven and Alyssa. Alyssa was actually at the same island as Steven. Um, I never really grew, grew too close to her. Um, I don't remember her being on the leaf too much. But she was there as well. And here's Steven's 
original leaf profile. I believe that dream address would still work. I was going to check it out today, but there's maintenance currently going on, so I can't. But for another video, I will before the server shut down. Um, he did play New Leaf quite a bit back then, and like I said, we played a lot. Kimmy, I played with quite a lot as well. I don't know what that four years is about. Um, I think she went to the military actually. Um, I was gonna add her on. I think I might be friends with her on Nintendo Switch, but. I've never played with her in New Horizons. Uh, Bunny, I don't know too much about her. She's from North Carolina. I don't think she's friends with Steven, though. Maybe she is, though. I would have to ask him. Uh, Kenny, I think I added him just because he's from Wisconsin. I always like meeting fellow Wisconsinites on the island. Uh, Timber, I played with her quite a bit as well. She actually celebrated my uh, town's anniversary with Steven one of those times. I believe she's in one of the pictures that I did for the um, Club Tournament and Beyond video. Jamie, I added her because she's from Wisconsin. Uh, these last few people I'm not too sure of. Neon. Again, these are all island people, like Club Tournament people, but I don't remember too much about these last ones. Uh, Megan. Once again, don't know. I don't know why it says I'm not a hacker because her badges. There's only three of them. I always love that about her. Uh, Juan, he was the one I played with with Steven. Uh, he disappeared one day and I never saw him again. Um, and then Ziggy, I still talk with her on occasion. And then this last one is Steven again, his most recent 3DS, which he, I believe, sent it to someone else, so can't play New Leaf with him currently, but maybe we'll get one video up in the final days. But if you were anyone in this BFF chat, let me know, because I'd be curious to speak with you guys if anyone is watching this video. I think the odds are probably pretty low that anyone's going to see this, but just wanted to kind of do a New Leaf video today, so yeah. Um, I'll probably do another leaf, new leaf video somewhere down the line, but I want to thank you guys all for watching and hope you have a good rest of your day.